Hello everyone. I am Dr. Mahboob, MD of Thermology from AIMS, New Delhi. So this video is dedicated to the strategy for preparation of INICET exam. One of the aspirants asked me how to make a strategy for INICET. So if you ask me which exam is tougher, NEET PG exam or INICET? My answer is very simple. NEET PG is tougher compared to INICT. The answer of this reason is very simple. NEET PG can give you a surprise anytime, but INICT will always be conceptual. They will, on an average, they will always ask the question on basic and clinical. So whatever the exam is, NEET PG, FMG or INICT, Broadly, I can divide it into the four components. The first component will be notes and videos. The second component will be the multiple choice question. The third component will be previous year questions. And the fourth component that is very important, revision. Coming to the first component that is notes and videos. No matter what institute notes or videos you are following. If you have a good notes, a good videos, a good note will always be the gold standard for the preparation. There is no any alternative for that. Remember. Now the question comes. They, if a person is well read with the notes and videos, you need not to run behind the rapid revision notes of any institute. Remember this. Your notes, if you have well read, should be the one to be revised. That is a gold standard. The second part of this, if you have read well some subject and other subjects are incompletely read, then my suggestion will be the subject which you have well read should be the revise should be kept for the revision for that subject on only and the subject which you are not well confident or very partially and completely read go for the rapid revision notes which you feel is good whichever is issue third if you think that you have not read any of the subject very well but you know something something about each and every subject my advice for the exam you should go for the rapid revision part and if a person has not read at all and they want to compete better drop this year because there is no alternative for the hard work you have to because even if you go for the rapid revision you will not understand anything not understand because obviously there is no alternative for the hard work there are so many people are competing and you cannot just bypass the road obviously you can do smart work only if you are doing hard work second component is multiple choice question mcq practice many of you are practicing mcq from this app from that app from telegram or from any other things you have to strategize if you are doing multiple choice question of an app from an institute you have to strategize that the question or mcq which you are feeling is hard you are not remembering you are forgetting you should bookmark that there is an option of bookmark that is a very excellent feature uh, of every app from every institute so bookmark that question the bookmarking is very important but one thing to remember don't bookmark everything because if you do so at last you will be very confused because there will there will be the so many mcqs to be revised so bookmarking should also be done smartly because the mcq which you think you have you have to see at last that has to be bookmarked not every mcq so this should be uh, for your practice pattern of this should be the practice of uh, MCQ, right? 
Now, the third component and very important for me, I am telling you this is a very important com important component for INICT. Previous year question. The three questions arised. How many previous year sets you have to do? For me, if you have time, go for 10 sets, 10 set. In one year, there are two sets. So five year, there are 10 sets. And if you don't have a time, minimum six sets is very important. And previous year questions is very important for INICT. If you are missing on that part, then you are not going to get any rank in INICT. Believe me. So previous year question for INICT is very, very, very important. Second question arises, analyze yourself. How to analyze question? Suppose you are going to uh, revise the previous year question, six sets of previous year question. Now, what I suggest, you do anatomy of all six sets in a stretch at once. Write down, suppose there are 10 questions of anatomy from each set. So there will be 60 questions of anatomy means maximum there will be the 60 topics so note down all the topics from the from where the question has arised in anatomy then you will feel that some of the topics is being repeated so that topic will become important for INICT because the trend is towards that topic second thing that you will analyze the type of question they are asking Either they are asking more image wise question, either they are asking more graph related question, either they are asking more multiple uh, cross and mismatch type of question. So this will help you to analyze by yourself. Don't depend on other institute person or institutional persons will tell you what is the important, uh, what is the trend. You can listen to them, but judge by yourself because when you judge yourself, you will be very confident of your preparation. So this is very important part. And third thing, what about other options? By saying this, I mean, suppose if a MCQ is there, previous year MCQ is there and the answer is B, but what about option A? What about option C? What about option D? Because today's option, previous year option, sorry, previous year options will be next year answer. So this is very important. You have to analyze the options of other options, other incorrect options of previous year MCQs because that will come, that will become the answer of next year MCQs. This is very important. Never forget this. This is how the smart people are working. And the last component is revision. The very important. How to do revision? Many people depends on rapid revision. No, this is a very wrong strategy. Don't depend upon the very rapid revision part of any institute. This is for the shape of just uh, taking the money that's it nothing else depend on your notes if you have well read notes is your gold standard repeatedly i am saying from today only you strategize you mark with yellow color red color whatever color you have that this is my last time revision notes this is my last time revision lines because this have to do i have to revise it that will help you if you are completely read with this notes will be your revision part revision book if you are obviously if you are not confident of any subject or if you are at like the last time if you are missing something revision last time revision notes or the rapid revision notes will be helpful but always depends on your instinct okay whatever you have read you have to concise them. You have to mark that this topic, this point I have to see in the last. Last one week is very important 
so keep tables and images for the last time last one week that is very important and the mcq uh, image mcq or the images which have been asked previously keep this before three days before the exam because they have a high potential of coming and you cannot do wrong in that this is how you can strategize your INICT exam because making a very long videos and each and everything there is a, this is not like that you have to analyze by yourself we can give you a broad idea about this what I follow is previous year questions I analyze the previous year questions the trend of previous year question when I was making I was preparing for the exam and that's I, how I got into AIMS. This is very important, man. If you have any query, please feel free to write. Okay, subscribe this. Thank you.